inside that courtroom right now. But I want to show you this. This was him a few minutes ago walking into court. His real name is Joseph McVeigh. He wouldn't answer any of my questions this morning, but investigators say McVeigh held a pistol when he... Zero's attorney did not mince words. I think all of this is a byproduct of the media brings standing over California attorney. What's up, gang? It's Frontline, and I'm back with another... Check this out, man. We got part two of the drama. Part two. So, today we got Charles Adam, the big angry lawyer, you know what I'm saying? Well prominent and known lawyer out of Houston, you know what I'm saying? He didn't chimed in, you know, uh, Zero and officially made him a part of his team, the One Deep Entertainment team. So, I'm guessing this guy's also an entertainment lawyer on top of just a criminal defense lawyer. But um, as everybody know in the city, this is the same lawyer that represented Zero when he was on the Jess Britney case. But this is his personal lawyer. He, we got his personal lawyer that chimed in on the situation of him getting jumped and, you know, confirming everything with all of the naysayers and people that believe that this actually didn't happen. Now, Zero then went and lawyered up and I believe a lawsuit is on the way. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. That's allegedly. That is totally my opinion. But, I mean, what else would you go get a lawyer for? And then, I'm also, not sure. we got with Jay Chun, show, you know, brother of the Trace run footage the and let y'all see. We got him showing his war rooms and his scars and, you know, basically responding to the lawyer in, a, you know, a little slick way. Also, letting everybody know, uh, also confirming about the situation, you know, basically letting everybody know he just walked away with a couple scratches in a swollen hand. So, you know. He cool, you know what I mean? So, I'm going to just let y'all see these pictures and y'all let me know in the comments. Do y'all feel like this is going too far at this point? Or, you know, do y'all feel like this could have just remained a family matter? Or do y'all think we finna go and get to the bottom of this? It's Lit TV. We back hitting y'all with the facts and the bangers. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, and get down in the comments. And, you know, let's get at it. Seven on one, but ain't do nothing toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Houston know who the bitch is. Some of y'all like, man, who is that? Who the hell is Chris Adams, big angry law? Oh, man, he go a clout chaser. Well, if you do your research on who that is right there, big Chris Adams, bingo. It's that white guy right there who do face-off on Fox News with uh, against Cornell X. This is a lawyer and an ex-police officer. I don't think a lawyer and an ex-police officer just put out a tweet that could get him sued for defamation of character if Zero the Crooked was not confronted and jumped on 7 to 1. 